Hello, hello. You have found your way to the Brevis Talk podcast, where our message is eternal, but our delivery isn't quite that long. Brief and encouraging. That's our goal. Now, here's your host, Pastor Wayne Whiteside. Press on. Brethren, I count not myself to have apprehended, but this one thing I do, forgetting those things which are behind and reaching forth unto those things which are before. I press toward the mark for the prize of the high calling of God in Christ Jesus. This is recorded in Philippians chapter 3, verse 13 and 14. You well know, and I will just simply bring this observation out, how much larger a windshield is on a vehicle as compared to a rearview mirror. You think that's important? Can you imagine a windshield being the size of a rearview mirror and the rearview mirror being the size of a windshield? Just swap them out in your mind. Why is the windshield so much larger? Because you're going forward. You need great visibility to the left and to the right and to the near and to the distant. The rearview mirror is that which is in the past. It may be important. There's a car coming behind you, uh, perhaps a, an emergency service car or vehicle coming behind you, and you need to know what's behind you, but it's not near as important as a moving vehicle knowing what is in front of it. You are moving in this life. The Apostle Paul said, I forget the things that are past, and I press on toward the prize of the high calling of the Lord Jesus Christ. Oh, my friend. The scripture says, forget the past. Some would say, dwell in the past. You can't dwell in the past. You can't bring it back. And you can't redo the past. And you can't relive the past. You deal with it. You ask God to forgive you and you get it under the blood of Christ if you have a sordid past and ask God and know God has forgiven you and cleansed you by his great power and you look toward the future. Paul had regrets. Paul was involved in the murder of Deacon Stephen. Paul did some horrible things. But the Apostle Paul was forgiven. He was cleansed by the blood of Christ. And he moved forward for the kingdom and in the kingdom. And he knew Jesus more and more with each passing day. I hope that your testimony is, I forget the past. And I put the past in the past, and I let it rest because I'm pressing on. Thanks for stopping by to be with us at the Brevis Talk podcast. If you want to know more about us or hear other brief messages, go to brevistalk.com and sign up to receive our blog and updates while you're there. Don't forget, Jesus loves you.